and welcome and we have an offering from Diorama Debris and I'll run through it as I normally do. Right, this is sold by Diorama Debris. It's a silicon rubber mould. Uh, this particular one is in 135th scale. Now this is a cut out wall section for a mould 1350072. And if you don't know what mould that is, that is the Victorian arch one. This is done in stretcher bond. The mould number for this particular mould is 1350073. Manufactured in the UK by RJ Norris. And we'll get it out of the bag. Now, got that upside down. As you can see, we have three parts to this mould. We have these two outside bits and as you can see we have the actual shape of the Victorian arch there so these two bits will go together and form over a single arch uh, it's also got all the plinths cut out of this brickwork which is pretty cool this piece in the section goes up in between these two sections and will give you then the double arch we also have uh, three bricks there which I'm not quite sure of what they're for but we will discover that after we've cast them out and talking of casting these out I shall get on now we'll get some cast out and we'll have a little look and see what comes out now this is what we actually get out the mould uh, a left and a right handed side to the arch and also the centre to make up for the double arch like so uh, molded quite nicely got no complaints that's about what I can say uh, well detailed and everything else I'm more than happy because at the end of the day I was going to do a build using the Victorian uh, arches but I couldn't work out a easy way to show people how to scribe out the two arches and Diorama Debris have done it for me. Right, we'll just have a quick look at them in situ. Right, the first one we're going to take a look at is just a single arch, and as you can see, it's engineered absolutely spot on. There is no problems at all with that. It fits exactly all the way around, which I am more than happy with. Uh, that's about all I can say about it. It's made to measure we'll take that one out and we'll bring this one in this one is the the blanche and yet again fits absolutely spot on there is no problems with that at all and it's going to make life so much easier when you come to use these arches and that is it that is about as much as i can actually say uh, about this little mold if you're going to be using if you've got the victorian arches this is a must uh, for you to actually do any building with it's going to save you a lot of time a lot of aggravation and it really does do exactly what it says on the label so that is it that is the end of this little review and it is a very short review but uh, there's nothing else I can say about this mold except for it's extremely good and it's going to do exactly what they say it's going to do. So thank you very much for joining me and uh, hopefully we'll see you on the next one. Until then, thank you.